Hello Capricorn and welcome back to my channel and this is your January reading for 2023. We're going to pull a few cards and see what's in store for you. Thank you very much for all the support my channel receives, the likes and subscribes and the comments. So far you've got the Five of Cups out and the Queen of Pentacles as well Capricorn. The Queen of Pentacles obviously that's you, you are an earth sign and that queen energy that queen of pentacles well, we know exactly what you're like capricorn you're grounded um you're family orientated you like to be stable um you can be affectionate you're definitely moving away from some sort of hurt we've got that five of cups and the eight of cups there it shows that you've seen her Capricorn, okay? You've seen it, you've experienced it, you've had to put up with it, you've had enough of it, okay? 2023 needs to be a year of no hurt. And as we say that, out comes the full card. Now what is the full card? The full card is a new journey. This here is telling me you've had enough of hurt, you're saying goodbye to it. You have put yourself in a position, a stronger mental position, where nobody's going to do that to you anymore, Capricorn. You're stronger now. Look at you. Really there in your power. Strong in your mind. And you're not going to allow hurt to get to you again. You're starting a new phase in your life, a new you, a stronger you. Okay, let's pull some cards to clarify this top row. In the description below, I'll put a link to some books that I'm um, selling. I'll also put a link to my sister's channel, Man's Iron Inspiration. She also releases monthly videos. You're moving forward. You're advancing forward in your life, but a life where you are in control. And it's interesting I say that because look at the bottom here. This feeling left out, the Five of Pentacles, sort of feeling pushed out. The High Priestess, okay? Not always seeing what's going on behind your back. These people that hurt you, they're people that would sort of do stuff behind your back. You Capricorn, you're the sort of person that just gets on with your life. You just get on with it. Other people are calculated. Other people um, sit there and actually work stuff out to try and be one step ahead. You're not like that, but these are the kind of people that you're walking away from, that you're leaving behind, okay? The Eight of Pentacles. You're really good with money. You've worked hard, you've saved hard. You've got stuff sorted there, even if it's training, okay? But you have worked hard, you've, you've organised yourself, you've got good foundations. You are leaving hurt behind, you've had enough of it. You want a different life. The life you want now is not one where you're pushed out, you're changing it. You are changing it, Capricorn, okay? You are having a new you, a new start. You are moving forward with strength. Like we said, you've got that three of pentacles. You're advancing forward in your life. And it's what you want, you moving forward. Like I say, you're not going to put up with hurt, with upset. You're probably starting new ventures, changes to do with money, business possibly starting a new business but you've got new things going on new things for you capricorn and these new things are going to keep you busy this is what you're working on in 2023 you're not going to have time for this hurt and upset anymore okay and there's possibly still some things going on around you at the minute probably not necessarily things that's hurt you in the past but there's still a little bit of crap i feel going on that you just need to sort and once you've sorted that you're going on your new journey, okay? There always seems to be something going on, something to sort, but 
you you were saying it now I've had enough of this things have got to get better things have got to change and that's what's happening and you're just going through the change and there's probably still some things to implement and put into place to make sure that this doesn't happen anymore that's the death card implement in the last few changes just look in your life Capricorn and see okay you've possibly already had a clear out. clear out you possibly already sorted some stuff but there's still a few more little bits to go and this is your guardian angel message. This card came out a few minutes ago when I was shaking them. And you've got the nine of abundance. And your guardian angel say, life is wonderful. Your hard work and dedication to your dreams will provide you great peace and contentment. Take time to enjoy quiet moments and reflection and leisure. Feel free to buy yourself small luxurious gifts. You've earned the financial security and independence you now enjoy. Wow. So that's just confirming what we said, that you're getting rid of the things that's hurt you. You're moving on to a new you, a stronger you. You've built this up, Capricorn. You have this independence, this wealth, this, this security that you've got around you at the moment, you've built up. And what your guardian angels are saying to you is enjoy the moment, Capricorn. Enjoy freeing yourself from problems, enjoy freeing yourself from hurt and pain and take that leap of faith into all these new things that's coming your way, what you've built up okay. If it's a business, it's expanding, it's getting busy. Just general work is improving. But it looks like your finances are fine and you're heading towards real good times and you just need to start enjoying it. Sometimes it's a little bit hard to believe, isn't it Capricorn, when good things happen. But it's coming your way and your guardian angel is saying to you, enjoy it. Have great peace and contentment. You've earned it. You've earned financial security and independence. Now enjoy it Capricorn. Let's have a look at love and relationships. It's telling you past life relationships you may have known each other before and red flags pay attention to them signs are cautioning you okay so in your love and relationships you may have known the person so for those of you in a relationship with someone you may have known this person already before and just watch out for any red flags cautioning you it may be that you're so excited rushing ahead onto these new things. Just don't leave your partner behind. Just make sure that you keep communication going between you. Just watch out for any sort of red flags coming up. And for those of you who are single, you could possibly meet somebody that you've known before, a past life relationship. And those red flags could be, if you've known that person before, you may have the same issues that you had previously. You may get that feeling that you've kind of been through this one before. You know, that deja vu kind of feeling. Well, Capricorn, so even though your reading talks a lot about the hurt and upset that you've had around you, it's a positive reading because it's telling you that you're now leaving this behind. You're now moving on to a new life, a life that you've built, you've put together, you've made this happen. The hurt is ending. You're saying goodbye to bad things and you're saying hello to good things. Wealth, abundance, happiness, it's all coming Capricorn, enjoy it, you deserve it, you've worked for it. Don't forget I've already got out year ahead videos for 2023, they've already out, if you've not watched yours now I'll put it on an end screen at the end of this video, so don't forget to click that Capricorn 2023 year ahead and see what the whole year holds for you. Thank you for watching, I'll see you again soon.